Hey guys, Jay here. You wouldn't believe it. This is probably my third or fourth take. In the last take, which I thought was really good, I never had turned the record on. So, you know, hey, when you get old, you forget. <laughs> oh well. Uh, today's Monday. Uh, you saw probably my uh, Alan Ginter box break. Uh, just not that those cards just don't excite me. I know good friends like Mike Go, he loves them, especially for TTMs. I need to get back into sending out more TTMs. I haven't sent in a while, probably because I have about a dozen or so. Uh, of course, it's probably the players I chose, uh, but just haven't come back yet. And I know I've seen videos where guys have had six months out, nine months out, a year. Um, I think even uh, Serenity Sports 50 Plus has had one out over 400 days. So I haven't given up, but I just haven't been doing a lot of TTMs. And uh, I'm really getting into the PSA grading my cards. I've got cards going like you've probably seen back in the 80s and 90s. And it's nice, even, I know a lot of them aren't worth a whole lot, but to me, they're my cards. And if I can get a 10 on a 1990, 91 card, you know, that's, I really like that. So that's what the hobby is about, is what I like. And uh, I like showing them to you guys because a lot of you guys really enjoy it. I love watching everybody else's videos when it comes to PSA cards. Um, Eastern Connecticut Sports Cards does a great job. Uh, he sent back my May submission. And not the best of grades. I remember sending those out. I was in a rush. I had to try to find a bunch of cards to send in, so I grabbed a bunch. And I really didn't figure they were the best, but I, wa I just like getting cards back every month. Um, if I hold off a month or two, it's, it's like, uh, when are they coming back? But if I do them every month, I've got it's like inventory coming back. So I enjoy that part of the hobby, I really do. Uh, I like buying singles. I've got some vintage that I'll show you. So without further ado, hey, let's go take a look. Alrighty, let's see what we get back from Eastern Connecticut Sports Cards in our May submission. First up is 1959 Topps Bill Mombouquet. I had picked this card up at the Shriners and thought it was a really nice sharp card. And I, This is his rookie card. So I thought I'd go ahead and get this graded, and it came out a nice mint seven. Um, there are 104 in a seven, and 125 that are better. Here we have a 1997 Pacific Philadelphia, Adam Vinatieri, near mint eight. I was really hoping this would get a nine. Uh, actually, there are 22 of these in an eight, and 115 that are better. So, a little disappointed in that one. I'll probably check it out even further. Uh, I did buy two of them at that show, and this one is came back a mint nine, so I was kind of happy with that. And there are um, 155 in the nines, and I think 60 tens. So, still not bad. I uh, can't wait till he gets into the uh, Hall of Fame. <laughs> I had this kicking around one of my boxes. 2000 Bowman Chrome, Roy Oswalt. Uh, came back a mint nine. Nice card. Uh, for Roy Oswalt, there are 422 of these in a nine. And there are 90 better. So it was just a card I had. I thought it looked really sharp. Um, so I decided to get it graded. Same with this one, 1998 Bowman Peyton Manning, Mint 9. There are uh, 1,475 of these in a 9 and 707 tens. Uh, but this is, you know, when you have something in your personal collection and you want to preserve it, I decided I'd do that. This one I was kind of pleased with. This is the 1998 Bowman Chrome Interstate. Peyton Manning, these were a little bit harder to find. Uh, this came back a mint nine. And there are 192 of these with 53 better. Pretty sharp card. 
and I bought a blaster box of Topps Heritage. And this is of Alex Bregman and Yuliski Guriel. And this came back Gem Mint 10. There are, at the time that I uh, got these back, there were 10 of these. So I'm sure there'll probably be, be a little bit more. Uh, Bregman's, uh, he hasn't been hitting well, but. And my last card is a 2016 Bowman Chrome Prospect of Cody Bellinger. Came back a nice, nice Gem Mint 10. Really, really happy with that. Uh, as of um, when I had submitted these and Mike got them back, um, there was only 134 of these. So still, you know, still low pop, I think, 134 out of 50 states, you know. I uh, figure of all the collectors, uh, not too bad. So it's, it's a really nice card. I really, really like it. So, guys, that's it for the uh, May submission. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Hey, we'll talk to you later. Thanks, guys. Bye. And don't forget, I will put these in the perfect fit sleeves.